I'd like to welcome you all to our 14th annual Sports Celebrity Dinner and Auction. This year, we are thrilled to welcome NHL stars Doug Gilmore, Dave Tiger Williams, Al Iafridi, and Tom Fergus. Rogers Sportsnet Major League Baseball analyst and former MLB catcher Greg Zahn, Canada's voice of thoroughbred racing, Dan Loisel, Canadian women's Olympic hockey hero, Tessa Bonhomme, Paralympian sledge hockey bronze medalist, Tyler McGregor, and Sportsnet broadcaster, Ken Reed. Uh, 14 bid, $1,500. All right, thank you both. So, $2,000, times three. You want to play, in, you want to be a one percenter? You got to have passion. And you need 100% passion. And that, that's all you need. And because if you have the passion, the attitude comes with it. So I think that's what Tiger says. You love what you do, you keep doing it. When they kick you down, you get right back up. I had a couple good years in junior. And the best thing that happened, 1982-83, St. Louis Blues, Ralston Farina was going to sell the club. Couldn't sell it at the time. So they went to the draft table. He says, don't draft a player. So I had a chance. <laughs> so that year, St. Louis Blues never drafted one player out of 12 picks. So that next year, I was one of the top drafts. <laughs> they thought I wanted to be a college boy, and I, I just wanted to play. And I, got, I went from being a projected like second or third round pick to a 17th round pick. Um, and I was small. The, 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 the scouts had to lie to get me drafted. They told the, the Orioles that I was 5'10", 170. Well, I'm not sure I'm still yet 5'10", and I didn't uh, You're definitely 170 now, though. Oh, no doubt. <laughs> oh, yeah. The hardest pitch to catch is definitely the knuckleball. It literally is like trying to pluck a butterfly out of the, out of the air with a pair of chopsticks. It's that hard, so, especially when it's good. And, and like in the World Series this year, so when, the, when that, those guys are knuckleball guys, and the guy's swinging the bat, I mean, how, how, do you, how do you do it? I mean, they do it all the time. They never miss it. How do they do it? Well, it, it's, uh, it's very difficult. It's a slow pitch, but at the end of the day, you know it's going to make one last minute move. It's always going to go up here and trick you and uh, bewilder you and entice you into thinking you're going to you know, crush it. But then at the end of the day, like most women, it breaks your heart. <laughs> <laughs> when you get out of bed, you boom! Your feet hit the floor. That is the bar. Where you take it from there is up to you. So get at it. And think like that every single day you're going to play. Thanks to your continued support through sponsorships, purchasing auction items, and attending this great event year after year, we have raised $270,000 and have been able to provide a yearly scholarship to each of our Milton area high schools, including the E.C. Drury High School for the Deaf.